So despite the fact that almost every church around the world has a program specifically designed for children and youth, many church leaders are still concerned about their younger population. A Barna Group just published a book called You Lost Me. Basically, research, widespread research in the U.S. why young people leave the church. This is Dr. Bambang Budianto. He's the Vice President of Asia Region for Compassion International. And reason number one, according to the research, is that the church is offer protecting their young and children. You cannot do this, you cannot do that, you're too young, what if you make mistake, and all those things, they left the church. I think the church need to learn the need of young people and children. Dr. Bang Bang is also part of a growing evangelical movement, focusing on what's known as the 414 window, which are children and youth ages 4 to 14 around the world. And they're advocating for the paramount role that children play in community transformation. But the church seems to suppress that. Sometimes I, I talk to churches who lost their youth and children. I ask them why. Some pastors came to me and said, well, because we are competing with entertainment, you know, Xbox, PS3, and others in the community. But after I talked with many young people and children, actually they left the church not because the church lacked entertainment. They left the church because they don't find any ideals that they can associate themselves with. Something that worth dying for, something that worth living for. The church responds to the loss of the youth through giving more entertainment in the church. Better music, more entertainment, it's okay, but that's not why they left the church. They want to find meaning for their life. And the 414 is basically responding to that need because that's their nature. God created young people and teenagers with their ideals. When you look at, in, in the Arab Springs, in Middle East, uh, everywhere in the world, in Indonesia in 98, in Philippines in 86, everywhere we thought the military will be the one that changed the nation. No, the young people. So why are we so slow then in catching on? And what can we as the church do to make space for children and youth to use their own gifts? And how can we equip them in finding their own unique voice within the community?